Welcome to my channel. It is August 27th. Happy Saturday. Let me show you today's drip. I just got an order right now. $103. 25 items. Try to knock it out in 25 minutes. I'm too freaking happy for this one. Like, woke up like without an alarm left the house got to costco literally at like 9 59 saw an order for 18 didn't want it saw one for 39 did not want it and then this one came up i clicked so fast i was like please please god god please got it got my 103 so i'm gonna knock this one out and stay positive positive. and yesterday's video i guess i didn't i i guess i from the comments i actually could have return the alcohol but i didn't know is because if you want 12 free stocks weeble is going to give you 12 free stocks i want you to go click the link in the description box below sign up for your new account deposit one penny go get yourself some free stocks and go get that free money thank you so much we love you weeble back to the pro this is my last item right here could not find it anywhere and i thought it was these two right here i was scanning these two both the health joint but it's this company it's like the same thing and my cart I found every item I had to so I didn't know yesterday that I could have actually re returned his alcohol because I told him in the video I was like um hey I'm just gonna return the alcohol and he's like no you're not so I was like whoa so I just felt like I had to wait for him I didn't want any problems or anything like that but a lot of you are saying that you wouldn't need like he was so drunk and like you would have just you would have dipped with the alcohol and like looking back i guess i i don't know when my when when would my time slot have been um like after i asked him do you remember you ordered instacart or when he sat down on the couch because after he sat down on the couch i was like man like bro I'm, I'm just gonna return it at this point so let me know in the comments down below and i'm gonna check out right now all right let's go And the first drop off is 22 minutes away and i think the second one is like another 25 from that one all right let's go i just did the first drop off and the second drop off is 23 minutes away and back to the old guy from yesterday like my boy called me and he was like man i saw the video i was like yeah what'd you think he was like you a real one for that like you had so much patience like you took a lot that was crazy and i'm like man i know he was like he tried to keep you inside. I was like, I know. I was trying to get out of there. Um, but it was so funny. Like, in the comments, you're telling me that you wouldn't have even, you wouldn't have given alcohol, right? Some people are even saying that I did way too much, like, as far as my patience goes, by me even helping them out, by me putting the alcohol on the counter, doing all that. Like, you're telling me I didn't have to do any of that stuff. And I'm just thinking, like, wait, so you guys would have just... You would've just dipped with the alcohol? You wouldn't have helped him with his cane or his walker or nothing like that, like. Cause I'm thinking like, I just, like I didn't want to leave him there, you know? Like, man, if anything, in my mind, I really want to be like, wait, what y'all, so y'all telling me that you would just leave like, fuck your cane, fuck your walker, and I'm taking the alcohol back. Like, man, y'all, y'all some thugs in the comments, I'm like. I just felt like I wanted to help him. And when I tried to go, he's like, wait. And I was like, like my heart's pounding. And he's like, I can't lift that. Put it on the counter, please. And I'm like, okay, all right, all right. And then I just wanted to get out of there. But, you know, let me know in the comments, like how you would have said it. Cause what I say, like, sir, I had already told him I'm gonna have to return the alcohol. But he said, no, you're not. So then what should I say? Like, sir, I think that you're too intoxicated. I'm gonna have to return it. Or do I say like, do you just tell him like, I think you're too drunk. I'm, I'm just gonna take the alcohol back. Or do I mention Instacart and say like, hey, cause someone in the, someone in the comments said that like in Canada, if you think that they're too drunk, like it's illegal or something like that. So if I think that he was too drunk, Type something for me in the type something for me professionally in the comments, like what 
what should have been my response back to make me feel okay to take the wine? Because when I said I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna return it, he told me no. I felt like, well, I just, I can't now because he said no. Say like, sir, like Instacart won't let me deliver the alcohol. I feel like I can't deliver it to you because of how you look or like because of your condition or like what would I say and like how would I say it? Or should I just have grabbed the alcohol when he was like, no, you're not. I should have been like, you know what, fuck you, I am. No, I'm just, I'm, I'm taking this shit back, bro. Homie, what's up? <laughs> no, I'm playing, but like, he, he, he was already like hot. Like he was already like red, like he was already I feel like he was already like just in a bad mood already yelling and stuff like that so i didn't want to like hype him up anymore i appreciate the positivity and people are saying like i shouldn't have had to go through that and like they're scared for me like i was scared too i was so scared that's why like i was barely talking because i was just thinking like so many thoughts in my mind like is he okay like is he is he drunk is he did he just wake up from a nap like i really couldn't is this who who, who he is like I didn't know what to pinpoint, so that's why that's why when I, I was standing at the door, I'm like, do you remember that you ordered Instacart? Because if he would have said no, that would have dipped right then with the alcohol. I think I was I think I was looking for my opportunity to take it back, but I was also just waiting for him to just find his ID because it's just policy. It's just it's just routine to me. But this one did stick out. This was probably like my 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 weirdest delivery to date. Just 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 because everything that unfolded like it's just weird of everything that happened but i'm gonna drop this order off all right let's go i got 104 for that one that's crazy i really don't even remember the last time i had 100 and well i think it was my 12 hour challenge but that was from walmart and i haven't i don't think i've had 100 from costco in a minute so this one was cool customer a tipped me 55 costco gave me 29 customer b 19 and everything added up to 104 so i'm super happy about this one let's manifest these fat orders i'm on the way back to costco i might stop at safeway or walmart because i have like i think it's like a 35 minute drive back to costco like i'm out here i'm out in the vineyards and if i see anything because it is saturday i probably will take it but i think costco is popping today or maybe the costco drop was popping i don't know my next order could be ten dollars I don't know, but I'm gonna keep working. I hope you kill it today and stay positive. I hope you make all your goals happen. All right, let's go. Someone said they would have called 911 and why would, what would you call 911 for? Like, what are you gonna tell them? And then someone else said that they would have done a welfare check afterwards. That's appropriate. I could see, I could see how you would wanna do a welfare check afterwards. Someone said in the comments, someone said he died that night. I, man, I hope I hope he didn't. And it's crazy because that situation, it does make your mind wonder about the guy. Cause now I'm wondering, yo, did he make it out the bathroom? Like <laughs> at this point, you know, it is what it is. And then use this, use my situation as a learning experience. I'm learning too from the comments. So it's good for everybody uh, to know what to do if you ever get in a situation like this. It's crazy. That is gonna do it for August 27th. Happy Saturday. If I do any more orders, I'll let you know tomorrow. For this order right here, I forgot to say, for the first drop off, it was 16 miles, and the second drop off was 13 miles. So a total of 30 miles, I'll take it. I did drive back to Costco, so that is 30 more miles. Let me know what is the craziest or weirdest delivery experience that you've ever had to go through. And that one for me in yesterday's video, that takes the cake. That that has to take the cake 100%. So stay positive, have a good day. I hope here it goes today. I hope here it goes tomorrow. And let's go get this money. All right, thanks for watching, take care. I will see you in the next video. It's KK Purge.